So, to examine the differences between our rocket design and one of the higher tech commercial rocket designs that you commonly see out there today, uh, we're going to fire this off with a similar set of rocket engines. Uh, you might ask uh, why we're using this instead of firing it at somebody. Um, and, and the truthful answer is HR says we're not allowed to use this anymore inside, so we figured we'd use it for the purposes of, uh, of science. So, um, a little update. The, uh, the depth of the uh, rocket retention well inside of this is uh, a little deeper than we're normally working with. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to seat it with the, uh, the final rocket and in order to ensure that, that we use the entire cavity, uh, we've used uh, one, uh, two boosters, oh, that one's upside down, wouldn't that be a surprise, uh, booster rockets for uh, stability. So, uh, so we're going to tape all these together. So I guess Ryan, since uh, again you're the expert, what do you think, uh, how many rockets, we have uh, three engines, mm -hmm. how many engines do you think are going to actually ignite? Hopefully one at least, right? I think at least one. Uh -huh. um, the second one probably won't ignite so much as blow up and kill us all horribly. All right, sounds good. My wife's uh, made sure that the life insurance payments are set up. So uh, let's tape this up and we'll go.